Hello, and welcome to the very first episode of Robert and Lindsay's Date Challenge. That's not what we should call it. What are we going to call it? <laughs> okay, <he's still> <laughs> Sorry. Hello, and welcome to the first episode of Robert and Lindsay Go Out. So is it going to be Robert and Lindsay, or Lindsay and Robert? Oh. Today, we are going to, a, we've made a challenge to go to a bookstore and uh, start a scavenger hunt. Scavenger hunt. Yes. yes. Sort of an anonymous scavenger hunt we're going to. Put a clue in one of the books, actually probably several books, so it is more likely to be found, and a starting clue, and then lead whoever finds it to various places in town, and um, they can... Find their way to the end. Yeah. <laughs> we're, we're not gonna... really sure what we're doing, but yeah, we're gonna do but we're gonna do something fun. We're gonna start with the clue in a bookstore and just see where it leads us. Yeah, so... kind of like the discoverer of the clue. Yeah, exactly. We're we're figuring it out as we go. We are kind of like our relationship, right? Right. <laughs> what are you doing? All right. Perfect weather for a anonymous scavenger hunt. Okay, here we are. Robert Sessy Carr oh, yes. <laughs> driving to get um, post-it notes or something to put our clues on, right? Yes. Gotta go to Walgreens or something. Mm -hmm. So that's an exciting adventure. Yes, we have these, there's a card index cards. We can do, well, I feel like it might be better if they stick in so they won't, don't fall out. I like your thinking, Gay. <laughs> Thanks, Carter. Oh, yeah, he's not really gay. <laughs> <laughs> it's just my last name. <laughs> If you were gay, we have a much bigger problem. Yeah, that would. Uh, finding sticky notes. Do we I don't know color? that we'd be going on dates. Do you want colored ones? Um, whatever is cheapest. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. They're the same. Cool. Success. We need like oh, we need colored sharpies to like write on them. We do, yeah. Should we just get a couple? Do we need? Do you want all those? Option. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, treasure seeker. You truly are a lucky creature. Aww. If you wish to find the gold... If you wish upon a star... If you wish upon a star, you might be Jiminy Cricket. Okay, so we, uh, we're shifting our approach just a little bit. We talked through and we decided that we're going to make all of the clues be hidden here at McKay. McKay used books, everybody. It's a magical place full of wonder. <laughs> And, le and leprechauns and, and unicorns. And, and, and leprechauns and unicorns in book and media sure. form. Probably. Yeah, definitely. Um, so we're going to work in reverse. Uh, all the clues are going to be here. And uh, then we're going to hide the first clue to start it off someplace public, like a bathroom or a we'll wall. We'll probably stick the first one in the, one each in the men's and women's bathroom. And then they can, you know, take the scavenger hunt around the bookstore to find. So. We'll put clues... A you know, depending on what books we hide the notes in. So. Exactly. I'm because excited. we're brilliant like that. Of course. Like, we're experts. Oh, yeah. We're totally pros at this. Definitely. Definitely. Clearly. This is not, like, the first vlog we've ever made or anything. No. This no, is, definitely not. Is this, is this the on button? <laughs> We've decided that the grand prize is going to be a song. Written by, written by us. Written, written and performed and, performed and delivered us. by us. Sign, seal, deliver, I'm yours. So, yeah, they can, at the end, we'll just have one of our email addresses and they can contact us. We can make up an the... email address. And what about the illustrated directory of. I can't talk, apparently. <laughs> the illustrated directory of guitars. That, that could be. Because the song will probably option. involve a guitar. It probably will. Let's do that. We might we might need to find something a little more obscure that people are not likely to pick up. I think we've I think we found a winner here. I mean that one's pretty pretty random. I don't think anyone's gonna come in here looking specifically yeah. for country the top country hits of nineteen ninety six. What do you think? Bingo. Okay, it says Congratulations, treasure seeker. You truly are a lucky creature. Write to us to claim your prize. A song for you is on the rise. And then we put our email address. Mm-hmm. Okay. We're gonna put it in top country hits of 1996 because that's a great year. Excellent year. 
clearly the best clearly. top pits. We'll just put it right in the front so it's easy. Because it's the last one, right? That certainly doesn't leave much to the imagination. Oh, let's put it in the top. That's good. Okay. A winner. Soon a winner you shall be. With help from Mr. Baldacci. This book you read without your eyes will lead you to a grand surprise. <laughs>